Among all indices, the PDW has been receiving attention due to its usefulness for distinguishing between reactive thrombocytosis and thrombocytosis associated with myeloproliferative disorder. Determination of the PDW reference range is fundamental, and the association of this parameter with the platelet number and mean platelet volume may be used for the diagnosis and differentiation of several pathologies. Platelet distribution width PDW, is an indication of variation in platelet size which can be a sign of active platelet release. Larger platelets are usually relatively young and more recently released from the bone marrow, while smaller platelets may be older and have been in circulation for a few days. Mean platelet volume, MPV, and platelet distribution width, PDW, are calculations performed by automated blood analyzers. MPV reflects the average size of platelets present in a person's sample of blood while PDW reflects how uniform the platelets are in size. These calculations can give the doctor additional information about platelets or about the cause of a high or low platelet count. The normal range for platelet distribution width, PDW, is 8.3 to 25.0 FL, while the normal range for mean platelet volume, MPV, is 8.6 to 15.5 FL. The normal range means the limits which your result should lie between. A normal PDW indicates platelets that are mostly the same size, while a high PDW means that platelet size varies greatly, a clue that there may be a disorder affecting platelets. Often, abnormal results will prompt additional testing. Under certain conditions, Platelets may clump together and falsely appear to be low in number or large in size so a blood smear may be performed to examine platelets directly using a microscope. Thanks for watching, please like and subscribe to reach more explanations. If you have a question, don't hesitate to leave it in a comment.